Okay, so hi and welcome to Tips Kalimba, where even you can learn how to play. Okay, I know this is too big for a kalimba because it's not a kalimba, <laughs> though there are some big kalimbas. But this is something out of what we usually do. So we are going to look at this instrument that I have wanted for so long. And now we have it. So let's check it out, shall we? Yes, this is a tongue drum. So when you get this tongue drum, it comes with a manual. It didn't tell you the scale or the specific notes included. So I think if they included that in the manual, it would make it easier for the player. So another thing included is your stickers. So it comes in black or transparent. So this thing is where you put your drumsticks on top of. So it's like a chopstick holder, but for your drumsticks. And of course, if you have a holder for your sticks, you need your sticks themselves. So here they are. And of course, they have this. Actually, I don't know what this is for. Though my theory is that maybe this is what they put here on the drumstick. And they also have this um, finger percussions. I think that's what this is called. As you can see, uh, the tongue drum that I got already has a bag included. And I love it. It's like, I don't know, I remember Ninja Turtles <laughs> from it. It looks like a turtle back. So here we go. We're going to open it. Ta-da! <laughs> yes, special shout out to Witty Birds because he has helped me in choosing the color. And here it is, kapatid. Okay. What I love about it is this design right here. It has this ethnic feel to it. It has stickers on it already. It's silver. But the thing you need to note about this tongue drum is that it's different from your kalimba in a sense that if the tone is lower, you're going to see a circle or the dot on the bottom of the number. While if that tone is higher, the dot will be on top of the number. While if there is no dot at all, so that's just your, the normal, the normal keys. So by the way, this is your 15 key tongue drum. The size of it is 13 inches and it is tuned to D. So let's hear how it sounds like. healing aspect to it especially if you take your time to play each note one by one and just let that resonance ring out What I imagine when I hear it is drops of water falling. Creating this ripple effect. As it spreads out peace. every part of your being. Wow. This is the first song that I have learned on the tongue drum. Let's listen to it, okay? And comment down below if you do know this song. 
I'm just curious to know who are the fans of this specific anime. Okay, so do you know what song that was? Before that character started singing that specific song, this is his line. <clears throat> Happy birthday, son. <laughs> Comparing to your kalimba, obviously this is way heavier. Another thing that you should consider when you want this tongue drum is that this is not the type that you can change the tone. I know that there are some tongue drums that you can change their tuning based on the magnet inside, but this one, it doesn't have any magnets. Um, again, with regards to fine tuning your tongue drum, I do not have that instrument that is supposed to be used to carve it. So that's another thing that I've noticed about it. By the way, if you're interested in this, I would gladly leave the link down below so you can check it out. And there you have it. Do expect to see more of this drum. So that's basically it. So may the Lord bless you and may he keep you and may his face shine upon you because he who promised is faithful and true. <laughs>